Hi guys, welcome to WebSense Pro. I'm your host Bilal Nasir with another Shopify tutorial video. And in this video, we will learn how to add custom account info icon in our latest version of Dawn theme. So after implementing this tutorial, you'll have your account info icon look like this, which is colorful, not as the original one, which is black and white and uh, it's, it's a little dull. So you can add colorful or any of your custom font icon to your Shopify store. And in this video, I'll teach you how to. If you want to learn, please stick to the video. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, comment on the video below, and let's get into it. So guys, in this video, we are adding custom account info icon. I've already created videos for custom search icon and custom cart icon. So if you want to replace all of these three icons you can watch the other videos and replace all of these icons and add your customized font icons which will look as per your theme okay uh, in order to add the account info icon i'll go to the shopify backend so currently that's how our theme looks like if i refresh it here so that's the default uh, font icons in header of Dawn theme 7.0.0 and that's the back end of Shopify. I'm going to click on online store. And from there, you can see I have added a late, I have added latest version of Dawn theme 18 minutes ago, and the version is 7.0.0. Now, in order to add custom account info icon, we will click on actions and then edit code. Before editing the code, duplicate your theme so in case you mess something up you can easily revert it back from your backups okay click on edit code and from there we will create a new snippet so click on snippets and then add a new snippet and we will name it icon account dash new click on done and we will add svg code in our icon dash account dash new liquid file so we can then place it on the header file okay so i'm going to go to flat icon in order to download some cool looking icons you can also do that if you have your if you don't have your custom icons so now search for account and here you can find great looking icons for free without paying anything so i have already used this one for uh recording let's do some other icon okay let's do this one click on the icon and then download the png i'm currently using the free version of flat icon so if you have the premium membership of flaticon.com you can directly download the svg and place the svg code in that file and then place it on header to add the icon but as I'm using the free one, I'll first download the PNG icon and then convert it to SVG in order to update in our Shopify theme. Okay, I, our icon is downloaded now. Now I'm going to convert it to SVG from PNG to SVG.com. That's the tool which I use to convert my PNGs into SVGs. Okay, now scroll down and here we will choose our file and upload it so that's the file which we downloaded click on that and now we will click on generate to generate our svg okay our svg icon has been generated so click on download svg our SVG has been downloaded now. Now I'm going to open this SVG in my Notepad++. Open new file, open the SVG. You can use any of the code editor. You can use Visual Studio or uh, Visual Code or any other IDE which you use for code editing. I'm currently using Notepad++. And after opening that file into your IDE, you can then copy the SVG code and place it on the new snippet which we created in our Shopify store. So paste the code and hit save. Our 
after saving the snippet let's search for header.liquid so that's our header.liquid file and in this file we will search for icon dash account and from here we will replace it with the file which we have created in our snippet so our file name is icon dash account dash new dot liquid i'm going to add dash new here as that's our file name copy this and then save let's search one more time if we have this icon mentioned anywhere else so there's one more time it's mentioned you can simply add dash new as our file name is icon dash account dash new click on save and after saving the file we'll go to our store and hit refresh okay guys as you can see our custom icon has been updated you can change the size of the icon from this SVG code so if you go to the starting of this code you can see that we have height and width mentioned we can adjust the size from it so let's try 30 from here and see how it looks click save okay hit refresh much better now it looks a little aligned with other icons as, you, uh, as I told you in this video before, you can also change search icon and cart icon as for the other videos which I have created before. I'll put the link in the video description so you'll be able to replace all these three icons without using any Shopify app. And that's it for the video guys. I hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, please don't forget to subscribe, comment and let me know in the comments what more you would like to learn in Shopify so I can help you with your Shopify development journey. Until next video. Have a great day.